You know, quickly I am being reminded about Joseph when he was in prison. The man stayed in prison for some years when he was arrested. The whole story, Potiphar's accused of rape and blah, 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 blah. But listen to this. One of the major things that happened to him was when he was being released and or when he was released and made second in command in the whole land of Egypt. You know what happened as well? He was given a wife. Yes, he was given a wife. Meaning, at the end of the day, remember, a wife is not an object. It's a human being who also have their own life, their own needs, wants, and all these things. So, it was not handed as an object, but that person is a person, it's an individual. A woman is a human being too. Or even if your husband is a human being too. So, when someone is given, it's not a thing like when you're just giving someone a gift, an object which there is no say. They were also in a season where they were waiting to be married, to find a husband, to be to, for their needs, whether it is uh, sexual and all, to be satisfied. And finally, when Joseph was released to her, when she was handed to him, she saw it as a blessing. Wow, finally I'm getting married. Yes, I'll have my own husband. So listen, to her, we just forget this. We're only focusing on Joseph, but the wife of Joseph whom he was given, also deep down so it is a blessing that the oh fortunate oh hallelujah mahalil the god whether whatever she was believing in the girls yes i'm finally given a husband so meaning the day joseph was released from prison it was also a blessing unto her so likewise the lord says your spouse your partner is being released to you in Jesus' mighty name, wherever they were trapped, whatever was delaying, was holding them, someone, your time has come. I decree and declare, let this word be yours. Receive it in the name of Jesus Christ. Your spouse, your partner is being released unto you. Receive in Jesus' mighty name, I pray. Amen. See you next time.